Para pa para pa to my young. Hi, hey, how are you, amigo? Today, you and me are gonna talk about Chinese AI robots. Are you with me? Of course you are. Let's go. go. Hi, my name is Magnus Detmar, I'm the Shanghai Vlogger. Thank you for watching this video. Thanks you for participating with people like me, like real life humans. I am human, I, you see I have acne and stuff. I'm a real life human because soon, YouTubers and anchors and everyone be, will be redundant because China got robots, and not any robots. Anchor robots. That's for me. That's just crazy that we have come 2019. They actually have anchor robots. So we heard a one about one a couple of months ago. That was for Xinhua state-owned news agency here in China. Hello, everyone. I'm an English artificial intelligence anchor. This is my very first day in Xinhua news agency. And that news anchor is actually modeled after Zhang Zhao. So that is a real news anchor my voice and appearance are modeled on Zhang Zhao a real anchor with Xinhua so I don't know if he's out of a job already but that new AI robot news anchor make a pretty badass job the development of the media industry calls for continuous innovation and deep integration with the international advanced technologies and he might be a little bit stiff and he might not be like all fluid like I am here however his new colleague is a girl and she got the moves so the new model that they created is after a girl and this girl is Xin Xiaomeng. I probably didn't pronounce that right. However, that robot doesn't only speak and move his mouth a little bit, it actually has facial expressions. That, for me that just blows my mind like how can you create a robot that realistically like a human we have been talking about this I have been dreaming about those robot robots since I was a little kid and now we're here now we have them as news anchors so 我和我的搭档将为大家带来更好的新闻体验。First of all, they can speak endlessly. They can just, unless you get like a, I don't know, shortage of power or something, they have to quit. But more than that, they can speak 24-7 live on any news channel and just keep going and going and going, which is ridiculous. I will work tirelessly to keep you informed as texts will be typed into my system uninterrupted. Also, they will never do anything wrong like I've done in this video like probably 10 times. They will always say the right thing with the right dialect with, with everything that's just perfect. I don't know though how it will integrate with like if another news anchor is, is on the field doing some reportage about some new awesome cool I don't know restaurants here in Shanghai maybe El Willis who knows if someone goes and do that can they just talk to to the person or can it only read I think right now they can only read this is just a start this is a frightening start, especially for, for YouTubers and other news anchors out there because we will be redundant. I guess we, they cannot be as spontaneous as we are, but... So the, these robots scares me a lot, but I'm also super excited about them because you can create so much stuff around a robot that just can keep talking, talking, talking. Imagine if you can implement songs or... I don't know, there, there's so many ways that you can form this type of person, but right now it's just normal clothing like anchor type of clothing i don't know if they have something underneath the cloth or if it's just like metallic Blew! that's just oh, i don't know it's a bit scary for me however please comment below if you think the same or if you think that okay screw all this all news anchors and all the youtubers robots are the way to go because we want professional news not like crazy i don't understand type of news comment below if you think so 
Anyways, that was a very short video for me today. Hope you have enjoyed it. My name is Magnus Detmar. Don't forget to subscribe. And I will see you very, very soon. Bye-bye.